What is up, everybody? Waffinator here, and it is Monday, Ugh. September 16th, and I have a shocking confessional video for you. And I'm probably going to catch a lot of hate for it, but hear me out. If you pay attention to my Twitter a lot lately, I am getting into the paranormal world and investigations, etc., etc., because I don't believe, but yet it, it still captures my imagination and fascination more than anything else out there besides maybe video games and music. So this is probably like my top three favorite things is like paranormal, the unexplainable, like UFO spirits. I don't believe, but I still find it fascinating. So the shocking confession I have is I'm going to be selling my Switch and probably about 90% of my collection to a local video game comic book store to support the local guy and fund my equipment for paranormal investigations. And it's not cheap. I mean, it's cheap, but just to drop all the cash up right up front it's not cheap so I'm gonna buy a few pieces of equipment and then like little by little I'll add more to get the investigations that much better so what does that mean as me being a part of the switch community and you know doing reviews for JP switch mania etc it means nothing my kid still has his switch so I'll still be able to use it and I'm gonna keep the games we'll play together you know like Super Mario World uh, Super Mario World Yoshi Story um, games that he doesn't have, that I have, that we'll still play together, I'm going to keep. And obviously I'm going to keep all my special collector's editions. Like, I'm still going to get Link when it comes out in a few days. I'm still going to get Luigi's Mansion 3. Because I plan on getting the Switch again, probably around Black Friday, and I'm going to get the updated model. So, if you don't see me posting a lot of Switch-related stuff lately, that is why. It is because I'm going to be selling the base Switch model I have. And probably about 90, like I said, 90% of my collection. And it will give me enough to fund and get my uh, investigation equipment that they get going. And I'm probably going to catch a lot of hate for this. But honestly, it is something I'm very passionate about lately. Because not once, but twice now, I've gone out and had very unexplainable events happen to me. If you follow my buddy Duke, he'll be posting a video. And I caught... A uh, really hard to explain voice and it's gonna be awesome to watch so pay attention to that and yesterday I went out to just do a vlog for my haunted lair channel my paranormal channel and I caught stuff without even trying and I can't explain any of it I know there was no bugs I know there was no insects so if you watch it on a big screen you'll see what I'm talking about like when I'm walking towards a statue because it was a children's graveyard and there's like a mother type statue. I don't, I'm not religious, so I don't know why. It, but there was like a mother statue with like a tombstone in a circle around it. But as I'm walking towards it, if you really pay attention, you'll see quick little flashes and like little orbs just going nuts. So actually, I'll probably be doing a full blown investigation at that. They say it is haunted because these are all kids that died of some type of flu back in the early 1900s. And also graves of unbaptized children which usually means purgatory and you don't go to heaven or hell you're just stuck in limbo so this is my shocking confession video if i catch a lot of hate i apologize but please like i said it's something i'm passionate about so i'm not doing it because i don't want to be a gamer because obviously i'm still going to game like i said i still got my kids switch i can use and i'm going to get the updated model probably around black friday it's just you might see me more on the quiet side when it comes to the Switch. I still got my PS4, and I'm probably going to be picking up Borderlands 3 for it because it looks fun, and I want to try it out myself. So that's this. Uh, that's what this shocking confessional video is about.